Are you taking me to see him? I said, are you taking me to see him? Hello? Hello. So you can hear me? Yes. Are you taking me to see him? I am asking, staggering by the way, if you are taking me to see Matthew Hopkins. You do know who he is. <laughs> Everyone knows the witch finder general. Sir, you timed it well. The trial starts in one hour, and a few of our witches died in jail overnight. Important to get the numbers. I just wanted to have a very quick word about my one. About your witch? Well, this was the issue I had hoped to... Thomasine Gooch used sorcery to kill a pig. Sworn depositions here too. Looks good. No, they all help. I had expected at least half a dozen to be brought by John Stern, but there's no sign. How did you get this pouch? It belongs to John Stern. John Stern's dead, sir. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh, John. Dear, dear John. A fine man and a truly good friend. I shall miss you very much. Still, we move on. Do you want to know how he died? No, don't think so. Unless, of course, she killed a John Stern. <laughs> <laughs> Oh. oh. No. Oh, this is fantastic. No, that was a theory. Oh, the but... court will adore this. And of course I shall need a new associate. I wonder if this is why you came here. Well, it was originally. After but... all, you bring me a witch by way of a calling card, like a dog with a dead bird in its mouth. But not just any dead bird. The bird whose sorcery killed my cherished right-hand man, my dear, dear friend. John. John! Because that kind of prize deserve rewarding. Come. Naturally, you will need some finer clothes, a better cloak, a wider hat, important to create the bright image. Uh, what are you, 38 chest? Uh, Susan! Uh, your residence shall be this one across the way. I like to keep a few homes dotted around the east of England, depending where work takes us. Uh, you there! You? Yes, it's Mr. Hopkins now, and uh, you're moving out, so you have the time it takes me to load this pistol to leave the premises. Thank you. That's Mrs. Stern, John's mother. Don't worry, they won't be long. It's uh, a lovely place, uh, similar to mine uh, here. Oh, Mary! I don't know if you've had much of a look around. I've loaded it. Uh, the previous owner did a tremendous job of it. Yeah. But um, he didn't want to give it up, truth be told. Good. Oh, the witches. <sighs> Sorry? They were witches? Oh, yes, yes. I uh, was paid a small fortune to prosecute their case, and uh, I ended up with this house into the bargain. <laughs> ah, Susan, uh, fetch my Angora cloak and my other hat. There's a good girl. Mm -hmm. Susan is very good. We thought at one time she was a witch. I undertook an investigation and turned out she wasn't one. So now she is my assistant. Yeah, a similar situation to the woman I brought. She seemed a witch initially, but then she might not be. I notice you have said that for a third time, even though I pointedly ignored the first two. Why is that, I wonder? Just that we have spent um, some days together. Her hooks are in you. Womankind is persuasive and wily. Witness how Eve convinced Adam to eat that fateful apple. Some scholars believe Adam didn't even like apples. God had only intended for her to be the first woman, but due to some sort of mix-up, also appears to have created the first slag. 